Yes. Our first guest, she starred as Hermione Granger in one of the most successful movies of all time. Do you like Harry Potter? Yeah! yeah. Me too. And if this past weekend is any indication, she's headed for yet another box office record with Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. Let's take a look. Please welcome Miss Emma Watson. Like three to pick from. Oh, no, you can have that one. That's okay. yours. Yes, yes. You, uh, thank you so much for coming. Oh, Love the point. movies. Great big fan of them. Love all the magic. I wish I could do all the stuff that you guys do, do in the movie. <laughs> Poof, and stuff just happens. Right. <laughs> yeah, she's like, yes, Wayne, you're stupid. Yes. Um, <laughs> so you have had a Galatians on the movie. How does it feel to... Now, this is the second one, and it's huge. Everyone loves it. Um, I... Well, I really enjoyed making the second one, and I really enjoyed watching the second one. Probably much more than I did the first one. So it's, I was really proud to see it, and it was kind of like this massive surprise because of all the special effects and everything. So it's really cool. You, you read all the books? Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm a massive fan. I was in the middle of, like, the third one when I started auditioning, and had finished, like, the fourth by the time I had the role. So massive fan. So how old are you, just to ask her? I am 12, going to be 13 in April. Well, happy early birthday. But it, you know, the reason I ask is because there is going to be a fourth movie. Mm -hmm. are, are they trying to make them quickly? Because, you know, you guys are, are getting older as you go along. You can't have Hermione and, and Harry. Yes, I'm Harry Potter, and this is my, this is my chamber of puberty. <laughs> you can't have, have that, that film happen. You can't have that. convenient because like it takes like a year to make the movie mm -hmm. and it's a year for the Hogwarts year so it's like we're growing up with the books and we're growing up with the film so it's kind of makes sense good I want to see you yeah. in the fourth one good so how did you get the role um my for some really fluky reason my the film studio just decided we're going to go to some schools around Oxford and so they just came to my one by chance and I was picked by chance and then it kind of keep, kept on going and then I completely couldn't believe that I got it because I hadn't done any professional acting before or anything so never never um, because of the success of the movies and now we see you on all the posters and yeah. you're out here doing promo have you gotten a chance to meet any really big celebrities um, I met Robin Williams the other night when I was in New York and did he know who you were Yes, he did. That's cool. Yes, that is very cool. Um, <laughs> um, I think I met Halle Berry, and I completely can believe it, because she came up to me and said, oh my God, are you Emma Watson? And I was going, oh my God, are you Halle Berry? <laughs> and then um, that was, yeah, I've met some really cool people. Too many to name. Oh, I'm sorry, the list is so grand. <laughs> Um, so what do you do when you're not working, forget all the movie star stuff, it's just you, you and, and you're hanging out? Um, well, school, which is a real, really big drag, but I still have to do it anyway. And I see my friends. I play hockey. Um, I you play hockey? It. Are you good? <laughs> good? Are you good? I'm okay, yeah. What position do you play? Um, I play... At the moment, I'm playing right link, but I'm moving around a lot. So, so w what's your favorite part part of the film? Because mine, mine, I love the special effects. I yeah. really dig the flying car, and it was really faithful to a lot of scenes that were described in in the book and yeah. and even the clip that we saw with uh, Moaning Mona. Moaning Myrtle. Where is that? Myrtle. Okay. Um, I really like the Gilderoy Lockhart scene because I thought that was really funny. Mm -hmm. Um, I really like the spider scene. Really good. But I was very scared. Did, did you have to have anything, anything made? You, you had a face mask. Yes, for the for the cat thing, I had a kind of it was a mask. It was kind of like makeup, and it was special effects all kind of rolled into one. It was good. And you had a special surprise in this movie. Kenneth Branagh yes. was in the film. That must have been great, man. Yeah. He's he's truly a lord of acting, as it were. He, yes, that's a very good English. That would sort of be the best English accent I have heard while I've been over. Is it really? <laughs> Tell the camera. <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> Kenneth Branagh was 
Um, I was really intimidated about meeting him and everything because he's like this amazing Shakespearean actor and everything. But he's really down to earth, he's really nice and everything, so that was really cool. B, before I let you go, I brought this out so everyone can see it. Have you seen these, these toys yet? These are courtesy of Mattel, and this is the whole chamber of the basilisk. And this is a really hot toy. And I think we even have your action figure. You know that you are large when you have an action figure. Let's see if the action figure, courtesy of Mattel, looks, looks anything like you. Can, can we get a close-up? Like, like, like really, yeah. So do you think it looks like you? Well, I hope not. Do you <laughs> why? I think it's that why? Well, it's like... <sighs> Well, besides the f well, no, the action figure is a little cross-eyed, I gotta admit. <laughs> no, you are not cross-eyed. I gotta admit, they're a little cross-eyed. But, but thank you so much, Mattel. This is gonna be a great toy this holiday season, and if you don't have the chance to hang out with, with Emma like I did, just go and buy the action figure. <laughs> and we're gonna give everyone here, we are giving you this. Check it out. Ready? Look at this. Wow, that's incredible, Wayne. How'd you get the toy to do that? See, look. <laughs> Now watch. You open the mouth. Yeah. And you slay the basilisk. Here, do you want this too? Yeah. The basilisk has got gas. I'm sorry, everyone. Here, you get your own set as well. Everyone, let's have Emma Watson, Harry Potter, the Chamber of Secrets, now playing. We'll be right back.